So this is a trom wall. The trom wall works by locking the summer sun with an eave and allowing the winter sun, based on your sun angle calculation, uh, to pass through this uh, exterior glazing. Uh, and so the heat passes through based on your solar heat gain coefficient being correct for winter sun. Uh, and the sun and thermal radiant material uh, absorb all that heat during the daytime while it bakes in the sun. And then at night, radiates into the space, uh, allowing for a nice warmth in the evening. When using a trauma wall, you can either choose to have it vented or non-vented. And in a vented setup, you're going to have a vent located at the top of the wall as well as the bottom of the wall. And then basically as the sun penetrates through the glazing and the cavity of air is heated, uh, the air is forced up in through the, the vent at the top of the wall and then it heats the space which forces the cold air at the bottom through the vent at the bottom, um, which basically creates a system of convection. Uh, otherwise, you have no vents and the wall essentially acts as a thermal mass and radiates all the heat that it gains uh, from baking all day long back into the structure overnight. So we created a pros and cons list uh, of trom walls. Um, the three biggest pros, I would say, are the, that it's a passive system, so it doesn't take ener any energy to create the heat. So that helps save you on energy costs, and also it uh, brings down life cycle costs. Um, it's also really easy to install. It's pretty much just a wall with some glass on top. It's not too difficult, not really complicated, and it's completely quiet, so it doesn't create a whole lot of noise throughout the building. All right, and I got the cons. So one big con is that geographically you can't use it anywhere. It's just, it has to be somewhere that has a lot of sunlight. And then it's a passive system, but you have to remember to close, if it's a vented system that you have to close it at night uh, or else it's gonna be too hot. And then if you don't design your eve right, the summer sun's gonna make it like way too hot if it's gonna hit straight onto the glazing. So those are your cons. And then finally, trom walls are primarily used in residential construction versus commercial construction because there's a lot of upfront design uh, requirements. Like most owners and designers don't want to deal with a whole entire wall glazing not being able to bring natural light to the building.